Hundreds are gathered today for the Women's March in Sacramento, but before their march, there was a rally where women of color gathered to talk about why today is so important. Women and men held their signs high and marched step by step to the Capitol to stand in solidarity with women. But earlier that morning at Met High School, another rally took place. To feel the solidarity and the power and strength that we have as women, and it's important for the, us to all come together for this event. Teresa Town joined other women of color to talk about the challenges they face day to day. The other day I got called uh, Pocahontas. Now, as a Native woman, that's probably one of the most insulting things you can call someone. Town brought along with her her two granddaughters so they could understand why they are marching. It's that stereotypical and being objectified as Native women that I don't want them to ever experience. Hearing people say it just made it feel more real and that it's actually happening and I'm not the only one that's seeing it. Alana Kai Pasquale is 14 years old and says she has already experienced discrimination and seen the hardship that can come with not being the man. When I go into public with my mom, who is a, a black woman, people will talk to her in very disrespectful manners and people naturally will treat her differently than they treat other uh, women or sometimes especially men. As she watches the women at today's rally dance and sing to celebrate how far they've come, she hopes change can also happen for her and the next generation. When change starts to happen, they're going to regret all the evil things that they said to other people.